not quite what I want. So what do you want? I want it to be like my house. Is your house very stylish? No. I mean, you can mark, OK? And you probably will. Instead of normal seats, wing-back chairs, I want a stone flag floor. Why not have a wood-burning stove? <laughs> yes. Quaint my ride. You want... A... Marie agreed to try a few things out, saying she'd meet me at a workshop in a week's time. Okay, take care. see you soon. Bye-bye. Right, be good. Get to work. Unfortunately, when we met up, it quickly became apparent that Marie had completely ignored my ideas and designed a vodka bar. This is what I have. What I have done is that I have actually created a little pod, which is for the drivers. On that side, on the passenger side, you've got a piece of glass which can uh, convert. It's an electric glass, which can become opaque. If the actual aim of the design is to create this relaxation mood, you but see, actually passengers no, no, can look, face one another. Tweed doesn't oh go with it. Yuck. <laughs> so no, you can't. Bit... <laughs> I but want Jamie, your doll's house is going to become a chairs. massive fire. I want wing backs and I want a stone floor. I left Marie to have a rethink and went to meet the builders. How many of you are Polish? You're Polish? Yeah. Oh, you're Polish. Yeah, Good. Yeah. Have you done a car before? No. No. Mm. Looking... Small bathrooms. Small bathrooms. Not cars. Think of it like that, but we don't need a bath putting in it. The first job was to strip the Merc of its plastic wood and ruched leather. I've got a good mind to go around to the boss of Mercedes Benz, to his house, and see if he's got any of that in it. I know you're not happy, but you're, you're designing the sort of thing I'm after, and that's important. This is not design. This is brilliant. I'm Look executing at... something silly here. It's not silly. It's a doll's house. No. How old are you, Jamie? Nine. Really? Going yes, on five? Yes, I'm nine. I, I know Going I don't look five. nine. I am nine. I've had an idea, OK? <laughs> we'll try it my way first, and then we'll finish. <laughs> Meanwhile, the Poles had found a problem with my intended location for the wood-burning stove. Is that the petrol tank? Your scheme is not going to work in this. I mean, hello. Let's be realistic. We have to move the petrol tank. We'll make a smaller petrol tank. That can't be very difficult. And then put it in the front passenger footwell. He's a real roast beef, I mean, with all due respect. <laughs> he has no idea about design, though, absolutely no idea. Finally, the centre console and all the seats were where they belonged, in a skin. So the problem we've got is that the floor at the back is raised. It's higher than the floor at the front. So where are we going to get a wing-back chair that's only two feet tall? It doesn't work. Your scheme does not work. No, this is why you gave in in the war. Oh, it's too difficult. This is much... This is what the British My do. My scheme is more... Oh, no, no, no. It's no, no, what no, we no, do. No, we no, see no, a problem no, no, no. and we think, how do we get around that? No, Ask it, them, they're it's Polish, just an they idea. know. <laughs> Marie felt car interior design should be done in a studio, but I was determined what we needed was a builder's yard. This is what I'm talking about. A cement mixer. Forget your welding, forget your plastic and your poppers. Some cement and some plasterboard. The cement would form a base for my stone flagged floor, and while it was being mixed, I introduced Marie to a builder's lunch. What do you mean? Ugh. What's the matter with chips with vinegar on them? Oh, this is vile. I mean, that is revolting. That is I'm... really revolting. The cement was finally ready. All this concrete together level is going to be two tons. Right, well, let's see how well this car's made then. Pour away and I'll watch the tire explode. Next, the door panels. And of course, Marie wanted something from the planet Zarg. This is fantastic. It comes in different colors. Jeremy, please, a little bit of style. But she lost that battle as well. This is going to be hideous, you realise that? Oh, I'm sorry, what's the matter with plaster? Oh, yes, but what you want to do with it is going to be hideous. When you hear this, just hear Agincourt. That's all you need to hear. This is a joke. That's not design. This is set design. Honestly. I mean, I would hate to see his house. I can imagine his parents having quite a lot of trouble with him as a child and again today, because he hasn't grown much, has he? With Anglo-French relations at an all-time low, it looked like the car would never actually be finished. But it was, and here it is! Yep. Welcome to Anne Hathaway's cottage. Um, 
as you can see, I've got a wooden floor in the uh, in the front, and then in the back, I've gone for stone flags. Uh, while we're there, we've got the log store, the wood-burning stove. <laughs> uh, there's a little bookcase with a globe on the top. Here's my wing back. I found one that fitted. Uh, and, of course, all the furniture is fully adjustable, like that. <laughs> this one, you see, goes forwards and back. And this is a really nice touch. <laughs> I think that. It is a work of genius, this. I mean, normally, everything I do on Top Gear either ends up in a hedge or at the bottom of a lake, but I really am properly proud of that. Yes. <laughs> well, to find out if his creation worked, we thought we'd take it out for a little test drive. <sighs> right, then. Adjust my seat. Right, you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Off. Go. Ah! Yeah, that's that's a design that's not, flaw. Yeah, that is a problem. Hang on. Stop. Why don't you go in the back? I'm going to go in the back. <laughs> <laughs> now, obviously, Jeremy had added quite a lot of weight to the car. So, how would it affect performance? So, this was a 2.8 litre six-cylinder, not to 60, about 11 seconds, with a concrete floor and floorboards on top of that. It's going to take longer than that. Well, I brought a stopwatch. Three, yes, two, yes, one, yes, go. Plant pots are over. Yeah. Flower arrangement sliding backwards quickly. Me globe, <laughs> me pots, me plants. <laughs> uh, we're approaching 35 miles an hour. This is the fastest Anne Hathaway's cottage has ever been. 43 miles an hour. Good, yes. If this gets any slower, we'll have to redecorate. It'll have gone out of oh, fashion. Oh, no! What? The chimney's fallen off. You're joking! Keep going. I am! 56 miles an hour. Hold on! 59! 60 miles an hour! 35.4 seconds. I'm going to have to brake fairly far. Whoa! Oh. 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 Having retrieved the chimney, we checked out the electrical systems. It's stuck. Reverse gear. Brake lights. Brake lights. They're on! They're not. Well, the brakes are on. Well, the brake lights aren't working. That's an MOT failure. It's more than that, mate. The wire for the brake lights... <laughs> the wire for the brake lights... Yeah. ..is on the floor, isn't it? Ah, under the concrete. Yes. He's concreted that in. Never mind. Time to turn up the heater and test the handling. We must now do a lap. Three, two, one, go! Plant pots. My seat's going back. Right turn coming up. Braced. Now I'm turning. Yeah. yeah, that's bad Nine. now. That's bad. That's bad, that wasn't. <laughs> James? Yes? Hammer in next! Oh, no! <laughs> turning in! Turning! Regain control <laughs> of the cottage! <laughs> no, it's OK! It's a pro man OK! Yeah, I'm bleeding quite a lot. James, I can see double. It's left. Now! Yeah! Now! Oh. Yeah! That went well. That went well. And uh, we're nearly there. Why are you doing that? Oh! 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 Across the line! <laughs> Do you know what? What? This is rubbish. Terrible.